honey bunnies welcome back it's me jenny how is everyone doing today okay my beautiful crafty friends we have a whole video from tuesday morning from the thrift shop and a few things that i got at mm, marshall's so i started stopped by the thrift shop uh over the weekend and i came across a few things that i thought were awesome so i found these really cute adorable little napkins like cotton nap napkins and they're just so cute it has like little ants on it and i thought they were adorable so i picked up four of these super cute right these little ants are just adorable adorable um and so i picked them up i thought these were really cute for the kitchen and then i found these silicone heart shape which i thought it was awesome you could put something hot uh, like a hot pan or hot plate or something and i thought it were awesome so i picked this one up a lot of the stuff from valentine's day was 50 percent off so a lot of this stuff cost me actually 50 cents this was a dollar and half price of this was 50 cents so most of the stuff that i got here were 50 cents i also picked up this uh valentine's day confetti i thought these were really 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 fun and i just love the shape of the confettis they're like lip or like they look like they're kisses um or like i guess lips right they're so cute though i don't know if you can see there but they're just really really fun for valentine's day these are cute sequins and then i found these um like random feathers i thought they were awesome i picked them up because they were 50 cents and i really really like the gold tip on it so i just grabbed um this all right and then the last thing that i came across um was this random like paper ribbon and i don't know i just it caught my attention i really really like the like the like the um like that vintagey look to it and the colors on this ribbon is just beautiful it's like a nice soft pink floral beautiful beautiful colors and it just caught my attention i i don't know what i'm gonna do with this but i it just i i had to get it because it just drew my attention and i love the way it looks so i grabbed two of these these were also 50 cents they were originally a dollar and you know 50 cents so i don't know what to do with this in the front it shows you like you can make bows or you can make like a heart shape um like heart shaped sign um i don't know what to do with it but i definitely am going to find some kind of project to use this okay all right that is for the thrifty shop i stopped by marshall's and i picked up some of these valentine's day socks i love to give valentine's day socks to my co-workers so i picked up a few of these i thought these were super cute and adorable with the cute little hearts this one has like the kitten so cute and then this has a cute little dog on it so these are really really fun i love i love giving them socks for valentine's day and so i picked up a few of these for them at marshall's now we're going to talk about tuesday morning oh tuesday morning they had tons of stuff for Tuesday morning. By the way, I forgot to show you guys. I did a haul video on Hobby Lobby. And I forgot to show you that they also had um, the Christmas stuff on, on clearance. They had a whole bunch of Christmas stuff left over. And I forgot to show you this to you guys. But I picked up a whole bunch of these really adorable Christmas ornaments. And um, I thought these were fun and adorable to use for valentine's day because it has that cute little like face on it right it's like a cloud um it's just so pretty i thought it would be really fun to do as a garland um the glass so you have to be really careful i, I probably am going to do this for my house i can't really take this for work because i work with children and if this falls on the floor and breaks we're in trouble so I'll probably keep this but I just thought these were so cute so keep an eye for ornaments that you can transform into other projects right 
Um, this can very easily be for Valentine's Day or even like for Easter or something like that. I just thought it was beautiful. So I'm going to use these ornaments. Um, I forgot to show you guys uh, these beautiful clouds on the last video. Okay, let's talk about Tuesday morning. Tuesday morning had awesome stuff that I just loved. So let me show you what I came across first. So I came across this paper, which I thought it was beautiful. You guys know how obsessed I am about the stars, the moon, um, anything that has to do with like, you know, the stars and the moons, obsessed, right? I'm obsessed with. So I came across this paper. It's called Story Time, and I love it. Love it. And it has a whole bunch of beautiful, like, moons and stars and clouds and, you know, like a galaxy kind of theme. And it's just beautiful. It also has the sticker. So let's look at it really quickly together. I haven't even seen what this looks like inside. I just grabbed it because the outside already caught my attention but we'll look at it together let me see if I can lift you up a little bit so that you can see here come in this way okay there we go so okay so here we go you have these beautiful oh this is like a book with stars coming out of it this is nice you get two of these and then the background has some script on it. Then you get this beautiful with the, oh my God, look at this like glittery moon with the stars hanging. That is beautiful. And then the back has this gorgeous moon with the little um, village in the bottom. This is so cute. You have a clock and you have a moon with stars. And look at those clouds. Oof. Beautiful. This is absolutely, I love, I love this, um, this paper. It's beautiful. You have a boy or a man standing and then he's kind of like grabbing the moon with this, like this black string. I love this paper i think this is beautiful you see that how gorgeous this is wow and on the back you have this beautiful scenery of the moon and some beautiful stars and clouds wow 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 okay and then you have the sticker pack which has a whole bunch of stuff here that you can use okay and that's it so you have a whole bunch of stuff in here that we can use to create a really nice project okay love it i absolutely love it actually i put this away in a later okay and then I came across this kit from Echo Park and it's called Blowing Kisses and it's really pretty. It's Valentine's Day. I bought two of these and they have really awesome, adorable little things in here for Valentine's Day. Let me show you in case you come across it. You can... Um, you have an idea of what you have in here. All right. So, with this kit, you get a sticker sheet, which is this one right here, and it has a whole bunch of beautiful stickers. Love them all. Okay. And then you get beautiful paper. You get this beautiful paper, which is absolutely gorgeous. And the back of it, these little tiny uh, love like letters or envelopes. Love envelopes, you see them? 
like little envelopes. So cute. Then you get um, this one with the little banner and the uh, red and white. You get this flower print with the script in the back that says follow your heart and know that it will always lead and know that it will always lead you to love. Oh, that's sweet. Um, true love. Story never ends. You are the love of my life. So many pretty um, written things back here. And then you get this one that has like a collage of a whole bunch of beautiful, gorgeous Valentine's Day stuff in here. And then you get this one like a little doily kind of icons. And then you get this one that has the black and white. It looks like chalk, like chalk kind of script, chalkboard. And then you get the hearts. And then you get these cutouts, little um, squares that you can use for embellishments or for projects. These are really cute. And then you get the, the polka dot ones in the back. Okay? These are like journaling cards. I love this paper. It's so cute. It has so many fun things in here that we can definitely use for Valentine's Day. So if you come across these, uh, make sure you um, pick at least one up. If not, two. Right? Because they're fun. They're fun to use. And you can definitely create a whole bunch of stuff using this paper okay very good then I picked up a few of these beautiful thickers um, alpha I have these already I bought these a few years ago um, but I do love the floral on this um alpha i just love it the, the the letters the letterings of the alphas are all in this floral beautiful greenery um design on it and it's just absolutely beautiful it's so so beautiful it's like breathtaking how gorgeous this thicker um is i love it so i picked up three of these okay and then I picked up a few stamps that I thought were oh, beautiful, beautiful. So the first stamp that I picked up was this one. Okay, so when I first saw this um, Maggie Home stamp, it's from Cray Paper, um, I loved the deer, okay? This is the only thing that I was interested in. I absolutely adore the deer. But you also have a bunny in here that is absolutely adorable. Hold on, let me show you because the price on it doesn't show you but you see that you have an adorable bunny you have an adorable bird adorable two little birds right here um but i was really really interested in the bunny and the the deer i thought the deer was so cute look at deer how adorable this is oh i love it so i picked this up and i picked up another one which i was obsessed over <clears throat> and this one the only thing that drew my attention to this stamp was this fox and the mushroom but everything else in here is also very very pretty and look at the fox how adorable he is i don't know if you can see there but he's just adorable the mushroom was really something that caught my attention. And then the little bunny was adorable. But everything else in this little stamp set is absolutely adorable. But this this is really what... Oh, and look at the owl. The owl also caught my attention as well. I mean, they're all beautiful, really. The squirrel is cute, too. They're all adorable. They're all really, really adorable. So I picked up this stamp. And then 
I found this stamp and I was like, oh my God, yes. I already have one that has like, like this here, but I have been looking for a um, either a stamp or a punch that gives me this um, like film um, embellishment kind of looking thing. And I haven't been able to find it. Well, I found it when I went to Tuesday morning. And this is, uh, I don't know if you guys remember, but okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I might have it, I might have it. Do I have it over here? No, I think I took it upstairs. Hold on one second, let me just see if I have it still here. No, I took it upstairs, but okay. But anyway, they have, back in the days, in my time, when I was younger, they used to have the, it was called, it's called, I think it's called a viewer, um, I don't know what it's called. It was like a little, like a little machine that you, um, put these little films in and you view, um, different images. Um, it's called a viewer or something. I forgot what it's called. I will link it at the bottom of the video so that you guys have an idea what I'm talking what I'm talking about <clears throat> and so I've been trying to think of a way to make embellishments that kind of resemble that um that film and so I've been having a hard time um finding or getting ideas on how to do that so when I came across this stamp I was super duper excited because it has one of those like little um film shape uh you know a stamp in here and so now I can definitely start making embellishments using the stamp so I am so excited that I came across the stamp um, love it I absolutely am obsessed with it and I am definitely going to start making a lot of embellishments using this okay so um, that is what I got at Hobby Lobby I'm sorry not Hobby Lobby Tuesday morning and um yeah that's all i got actually that's i think that's more than enough um i hope that you guys enjoy watching um, this video i hope that you got ideas um and know what to look for if you happen to stop by tuesday morning make sure you thumbs up make sure you subscribe i love you all have a fantastic weekend be safe out there and i will see you soon on my next video Mwah! bye honey bunnies